look at this. The five male cheetah we were hoping to find. And this is interesting because the area that they were in yesterday is an area called Hamakop, which is a kind of bird. It's a kind of marshy area. And the last time I was with them there, we followed them at night. And they came into this general area, scent marked on that tree behind them to the left. Some of them actually climbed that tree during one of the TV shows. So I thought our plan for this morning would be to take the same path that they kind of used to leave that area the last time they were there. Oh, they're hunting. Should we move or should we stay? Let me move it a little closer. There's a hill in our way. Whoa, hold on, everyone. Uh oh, uh oh, they're running. There might be some bumps here. Hold on, everyone. Yes, there's one lone GNU that, that they're going to bear down. I just need to get into a good spot. Give me a second. We've still got some time to get into a good spot, but they are bearing down on it. I cannot believe how lucky our timing is. Okay, I'm going to have to stop. Manu, get ready here. To the right, to the right, to the right, zoom out, it's in front of this green car now, straight in front of the green car, stay there, there we go, can you believe this, our timing has been absolutely ridiculous and this cheetah has just, no, not yet, not yet, this wildebeest is still going, will the chase continue, it is going to continue, we're not going to move, there's still more cheetah chasing it and they're not going to give up, we do need to move closer, sorry everyone, they are not going to leave this wildebeest until they get it. There's enough of them to relay through it. I'm going to stop here quickly, Marnie. You on it? I cannot believe how long this chase has been. But this wildebeest, I think, is done. It's simply too tired. One wildebeest against five cheetah was just not a fair match. I am absolutely trembling with excitement and shock. Welcome everyone who has just joined us on other networks. We have just stumbled across these cheetahs about two minutes ago and they started chasing down this wildebeest that you can see is in a spot of bother. There are four more cheetahs arriving onto the scene shortly. They are a coalition of five males and what an incredibly lucky start to the morning. Whew, let's get a bit closer. We've had to stop <clears throat> in order to make sure we get the takedown. Hello to AB. I'm told that cheetahs are the only predator that you cheer for during their hunts. And that must have been a very good opportunity for you to scream and shout for them because that was one of the most incredible chases and takedowns that I've ever seen these five males make. Absolutely fascinating. They chased that wildebeest for about almost, I'd say, three quarters of a mile. It was an incredibly long chase. Now, Andy, you'd like to know where the others are. They're all coming in. Like I said, it was a long chase, and some of them obviously had faith in the front runners to dispatch this wildebeest. There you can see another one coming in. What an absolutely beautiful day it is, and to be spoilt with this kind of an action is something that we should all be very, very grateful for. That was absolutely epic. Whew. We certainly had to drop the clutch to get into position and jam on brakes in order for Manu to do his business. And these cheetah are absolute killing machines. They have successfully taken down numerous, numerous wildebeest live on our safaris and I think, for me, this has been the most exciting moment. 
Now, what's interesting, just before we stumbled upon these cheetah, we came across a carcass of a wildebeest. Only one leg had been eaten. This is Dartonian. He's got a collar on. And why I was talking about that other carcass is the reason we're looking at this guy here. He's not even feeding. He's not even concerned about snacking just yet. There's so much food around for the predators that a whole carcass behind us was abandoned and these predators are certainly acting quite differently to the, how they ordinarily would. As soon as a kill is usually made, the predators will often fight amongst one another and all be trying to snack as quick as possible. But here you can see it's not quite the case. Philippa, you'd like to know if this was an adult wildebeest? No, it seemed to me like it was a youngster that would have been born in the southern Serengeti Plains earlier this year, in about January or February. So they're about eight months old now. Getting quite big, but not big enough to put up a challenge for these cheetah. They can even manage to bring down bigger wildebeest than this. We have seen them take down two three-year-old wildebeest. And it's their unique scenario of being in a coalition this large that allows them to take down bigger prey. I'm just gonna spin the vehicle around quickly. Have a look at D'Artoni and just to show his body language there, Manu. You can see he's looking very intently at something. So just wanna swing the vehicle around and see if there's not any hyena coming onto the scene. What is it that he's seen over here? Let's have a look across there, Manu. Thompson's gazelle. No threats that I can see immediately. Not sure if you guys can see anything that I'm missing. But it seems all clear for now. For all we know, you could be looking at another cheetah, lion. There are so many options. Hello, Roshni. You'd like to know if I have ever seen a cheetah bring down a zebra or any other large kind of prey species like that and no i personally haven't the wildebeest is the largest prey species i've seen the cheetah take down but brent did see them take down a zebra it was stolen shortly after they took it down by a hyena but certainly they can take down zebra usually i'd say i think it's fair to say that zebra and wildebeest are the biggest prey that these guys will try and take down anything larger than that is going to be a bit tricky Okay, well, to everyone who joined on Facebook, thank you very much. Sorry we missed the takedown. It was all so quick and chaotic that it all happened. But make sure you stay tuned in for other action that may pop up a little bit later on today.